Welcome to Spotlight on Southern Indiana. I'm Troy McCormick, and I'm here at the Stucker Fork Fish and Wildlife Area with Mick Rutherford, a fur trapper. And we're going to be out today running his muskrat and beaver line to see how lucky we get. Mick, when did we? Uh, when did you set these traps? Uh, started two days ago and finished putting the line out yesterday. Great. And you had some success yesterday, but you had more traps you put out, so we should have a pretty good day today. Yeah, we should have a real good day today. That's great. We're going to be out wading through this uh, wetland area, uh, checking uh, Beaver Lodge and muskrat houses, and uh, we'll see how his uh, trap line runs today. All right. Tell me, Mick, how many traps do you have out? We've got about 100 traps out here. Um, there's probably 60 or 70 muskrat houses out here, so we haven't got them all set. What we try to do is take the you know, majority of the muskrats in five or six days and get out and we'll leave plenty you know, to reproduce and we'll have another batch probably just like this next year. Well, how long does it take to run a hundred traps? Um, well, yesterday we were still setting, usually probably three or four hours. We're out here with your dad today, Mick. Did he teach you how to trap? And my dad taught me to trap when I was, I started when I was probably eight or nine years old, uh, trapping in the creek behind the house. So that, that's what got me started. Trapping's kind of down from what it used to be back in the late 70s when I ran a trap line. Tell me about the market and prices and values of muskrats today. Um, yeah, back in the late 70s, muskrats were about five or six dollars a piece. Had a real decline. Uh, there was years there where they were about a dollar. They're back up to about three dollars right now. What's the value of a beaver pelt right now? Beaver probably average eighteen to twenty dollars, depending on the size. And this is a probably a juvenile beaver. Probably about a twenty pounder. Flat tail you hear about slapping the tail. Look at those back feet. push themselves along with. Tell me about the number of beaver we might find in a lodge this size. There'll be two adults, they're breeding pair, and they'll keep their young for stay at the house for two years. So there could be six to uh, eight beaver in this house. That's it for today, and this is Troy McCormick with your Spotlight on Southern Indiana.